This is a short video on how to remove alcohol from your fuel. In New Jersey, uh, all fuel has alcohol in it. So this is good if you have a chainsaw or a weed whacker or even a lawnmower. It, it'll run a lot better if it doesn't have alcohol in it. Get any type of container that's somewhat clear that has a, a nice sealing cap on it and this is going to hold uh, the fuel that you're going to put in there and the pla clear plastic or glass will allow you to see uh, through and what's happening. On the cap drill a small eighth inch hole or so near the edge, anywhere near the edge and this will be used for draining off the alcohol you don't want to put it in the center because then it, uh, it, you won't get all the water out. It'll be trapped in the center. When you place your fuel in your container, whichever you choose, uh, add a, roughly a cup of water to it. What the water will do is collect all the alcohol. And if you mark it, you will notice that the level of the water that you placed in there will actually go up. And that's from it combining with the alcohol. So the water will actually pull all the alcohol out of your... With your finger on the hole, flip it over and you'll notice all the water and alcohol will go and settle around the cap. Once you release your finger from the hole, all the alcohol and water will drain out. With the hole in the edge it allows you to drain all the water and none of it remains uh, and you'll lose less of the fuel that way uh, versus it being in the middle of the hole. You, there still might be some water trapped in there. Thank you for watching. Visit us at LarryAndJane.com Here's a copy of my latest book. It's called Presidential Treason of Three Stooges. I think you'll like it. It's available from Amazon. Thank you again.